Dead Grin Immortals. You are watching Dead Grin's Customs. Like this video and subscribe to this channel before I destroy you all. Don't you like this color? Isn't it as beautiful as his customs? Go on, worship this channel, or else. Hey, Dead Grinners, welcome to another episode of Dead Grin's Customs. Uh, today's episode is going to be following up on my uh, custom Dragon Stars Kale figure um, using the uh, Dragon Stars Kaba for the base figure. Now, uh, a lot has happened since the last update. What I ended up doing is I ended up um, like putting some milliput on her back, like to be able to you know cover up those straps that were on her back, and uh, I I ended up putting some lines in to make it look like some wrinkled shirt. Um, I also uh, added milliput to the belt um, because the belt was too thin for the for the leather that I had put over or the plastic the rubbery plastic that I had put for her skirt. And then um, what else did I do? Oh, and then I covered and sanded down the uh, her stomach and uh, the the back. That way, it, it would look more like skin instead of armor. So. Aside from that, I took the Kaba head, I took off all the spikes, and then I um, kept the bang, because, uh, I mean, she has a longer bang, but I, I didn't want to sculpt another bang. And then um, I ended up reshaping the whole hair, like, sculpting it to make it like a, like it's being pulled back. And then I took individual spikes and put them all together to make the actual, like, tied up hair part. Um, to connect them, I ended up using my Dremel to like drill a hole and then I pl place these plastic um, pegs that come with uh, world collectible figures and then um, I did the same thing to the spikes and then I, I put them together uh, I'm not completely done guys I still gotta do the gauntlets um, I gotta do the shoes and then um, I also have to uh, figure out the, the the eyes I wanna figure out if I if I should just um, color the eyes at that he has in or if I want to completely uh, like put the eyebrows in a different placement but yeah guys you know so that's basically all that happened and I, I added color like brown for the belt red for the shirt and the skirt I did a uh, like a blackish brown for the pants the gauntlets I'm probably gonna do either yellow to match the dragon star scale or something similar and um, I did black for the hair and that's about it that's all I've done oh and then I did some skin tone for the actual stomach i tried to get as close as i could to the actual skin tone of you know the figure itself so let me know what you guys think did i do a good job so far does it look kind of weird does it look like kaba in drag or does it look like a completely new figure i personally think it looks more feminine like um the way i did the, the skirt it added more of a feminine shape like for the hips and then um obviously the chest like i didn't go overboard but i didn't um being them too small to where it would still look kind of mannish. Overall, I think I did a pretty good job. But let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. Remember to uh, visit Frankie Culture at frankieculture.com. Um, you can also follow them on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. And you can also follow me, Dead Grins Customs, on those same social media platforms. Um, hit the like button and subscribe and share if you haven't already. Make sure you gallic gun that notification bell. And um, let me know, again, let me know what you guys think in the comment section, guys. I love interacting with you guys. I love hearing you guys' opinions. Um, that's basically it for this video. So, like I always say, um, if you're watching this in the morning, good morning. And for everybody else, good afternoon, good evening, and good night.